No. WFXR Sports. Ah, uh, yes. Good evening, everyone. I'm Jermaine Farrell. Hoping your day is wonderful and blessed. Time now for the latest in sports news. We're here at Liberty University where the Liberty Flames are on fire as they are 7-0. and oh, And there's an old saying, would you rather have a pretty loss or an ugly win? And the Liberty Flames took the ugly win. They beat Middle Tennessee State last night at Williams Stadium by the score of 42-35. to 35. When you look at the ball game, the Liberty Flames and the Middle Tennessee State Blue Raiders were up and down the field. It was tied at 21 at halftime, but then in the second half, the Liberty Flames, they clamped down on defense, particularly in the fourth quarter, as they held Middle Tennessee State to 45 yards of total offense, and they got key turnovers, and they turned what could have been a devastating loss into a happy win for the Flames. I think our, our team's resilient. Uh, obviously, uh, and uh, I think they're buying into what you know what we uh, believe in and what we preach. Um, you know, we, we almost learned a Bible lesson. You know, we got really close to that touching that fire, and it about cost us. And 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 hopefully, I'm glad we're learning in a win. You know, that we can that we learn we have to learn how to practice and not take things for granted. Uh, I told the team last night in a, in a meeting there that I'm an '80s. I love '80s music, and one of the songs there was "Don't Know What You Got Till It's Gone." You know, and uh, and like. I referenced losing, uh, losing an opponent that we were better than because we thought we were better and we didn't prepare, and, and that's where all our championships came from. And I talked about that is that man, we're on such a special thing going. Don't take it for granted. No, actually, I didn't even know until I just went in the locker room and somebody said, you rushed for, well, actually, Cooley came up to me and said, bro, you ran for 160 yards. I was like, oh, crap, I didn't know that. <laughs> Yeah, I think that just starts in practice. The coaches put us in, you know, uncomfortable situations in, in, in practice, and, and it shows in the games, and it shows how much confidence we have in each other to just, you know, keep rolling, keep rolling, regardless of how the, how the game's going. So the Liberty Flames, they have a big one coming up next Tuesday. They're 7-0 and overall. They're also perfect in conference play. They take on Western Kentucky as they'll face the Hilltoppers at Western Kentucky as Liberty looks to drive on and stay perfect on the season. For now, we are here at Liberty University in Lynchburg. Jermaine Farrell, WFXR Sports. Let's get a final update on your four.